because the performance is a contribution of both the trainees and the trainers. But of course, if the student did not perform well, then the teacher has to explain. And therefore, if uh, we have such kind of a council trainer who does not help our students, you know, perform well, acquire the skills that are required and knowledge, then with that, we cannot now contract him again. We can't renew the contract. Shughuli zilikuwa si haba wanafunzi wakikalia mitihani yao ya kufunga shule katika chuo cha kiufundi cha Kenya Coast Poly. Televisheni ya Coast News TV tulipata fursa ya kuzungumza moja kwa moja na naibu wa mwalimu mkuu B Kariuki. Kariuki akizungumza nasi alisema kuwa mtihani huo umekaliwa na wanafunzi 2710 na watano. Jean Kariuki, uh, the deputy principal in charge of academics. This term we are supposed to have internal exams and uh, we are supposed to have 2,715 students sitting for the internal exams. And uh, the exams have started off this morning at uh, 8, that is when the students were starting. And uh, the turnout was good, the students were punctual. And uh, the few who came a bit late, they were also allowed because we allow the first 30 minutes. Bikariuki vile vile alieleza kuridhishwa na jinsi wanafunzi walivyo jiandaa kufanya mtiani huo huku pia akisema swala la uhaba wa viti katika chuo cha Kenya Coast kwa sasa limetupwa katika kaburi la sahau. In all the rooms, the students were there by 8.30. Uh, this time because of also the few students we have, that is 2,715, we do not have issues of uh, furniture as we have had before. Uh, in the past, we have had issues of chairs because uh, the students in our uh, institution are quite many and uh, therefore they struggle from one room to the other transferring the seats. But this time, because of the low number, we did not have that. And therefore, we had a very smooth, smooth start. Uh, of the examinations. The rooms were also enough. Uh, the infrigeration was done and the, the infrigerators got in in time. Uh, there was also good supervision coordination between the heads of department and those who are supervising, that is the, the heads of uh, section, were all there in time. In the examination office, the coordinator, the internal examination coordinator was also there and his two assistants and they did good work. And therefore everything was settled and the students did good work. The frisking was done, and therefore, and it was realized that this time the students are actually uh, very honest, and they really want to do honest work. And uh, the idea of having uh, some more Kenyans or uh, materials that uh, can give them access uh, to uh, the answers was not there. Our compound, the students are actually seated, you know, in groups doing some little discussions here and there. The others who are in the library, the libraries are actually packed. I had even to go to the library even to, uh, to request that the e-widows be opened so that we can have airing because the, the, the library is actually packed with the students. They are really serious with the preparations. Therefore, we are hoping that even tomorrow uh, we will not have issues and I urge them to continue in the same way so that they can prepare well for the exams. And then when it comes to those who are administering exams, uh, if they continue actually getting to the institution in good time, picking the papers in good time, frisking in good time, and being there throughout, then we'll have smooth running of these uh, examinations. So far, so good, and I'm hoping that even the rest of the days up to Wednesday, we'll not have issues in the examination. At least there is some uh, improvement, and a lot of improvement, when it comes to the management of the examinations. Akiguzia pia matokeo ya mtiani ya NEC ya June July series, Bikariuki alisema kuwa uongozi wa shule utaka chini na kuchambua matokeo hayo, Juma Lijalo. That, when we got the results, we could not immediately do the analysis, but it was done in departments. Therefore, to know the performance of uh, the whole polytechnic, we'll sit down next week as soon as we are through with these internal exams because our minds right now, are on the internal examinations. But as soon as we are through, then we'll do the analysis uh, for the polytechnic and we'll be in a position to 
uh, at, at, at least give the position of uh, our performance this year. Uh, otherwise, as far as departments are concerned, they're already recording a lot of improvement in uh, almost all the subjects. And therefore, we are hoping that January will have improvement. Otherwise, right now, we are embarking on this. And then uh, these exams are running all the way to, uh, to 17th. And then we shall use the 18th to organize uh, for the candidates who are supposed to carry out the exams on 22nd. And uh, on 19th, that is when they will have the rehearsals. So right now, we are busy now with that. At the same time, we also have um, CIDAC, you know, exams that are actually going on. They started today. So we are running the CIDAC exams. We also have the nursing council here, uh, also carrying out the exams in our hall, our big hall called Chadaria Hall. And then we have internal exams. Therefore, those three exams are going on concurrently. And therefore, uh, we may not be in a position to uh, give more um, give time for the analysis at this particular time, although it is also very necessary. So um, because of the busy schedule that we had last week, we could not. This week we are busy administering the exams and therefore next week, as soon as we are through, then we can sit down such that as the neck continues, then we can sit down and arise on how we performed in the July neck exams. Vile vile akidokeza jinsi shule imejiandaa kwa muhula ujao Bikarioki aliongeza kuwa usimamizi wa shule umeunda mbinu za kuhakikisha shule inapata wa kufunzi bora muhula ujao What happens is that as we go out for holiday we prepare for the following term by making requisitions in good time and therefore right now the heads of department must prepare for next term they make the requisitions for the teaching and running materials, just also in case there are equipments that are required for the practical work, they make requisitions such that the procurement process is followed during the holiday and by the time the students are back and also the trainers are back, then the equipment is here. And therefore, uh, concerning either generalism class or any other, we are expecting that as at now, this is when everybody is making requisitions for, the, uh, for next term. And therefore, I am hoping that at least by the end of the week, by the time we are through the examinations, the HODs are also through with making their requisitions so that the procurement procedure can start. Now, concerning our trainers, what, also, what we also do is that we also do what we call allocations at the end of the term. Before we close, we do the allocations. And uh, we allocate work to the uh, Public Service uh, Commission trainers that is, these are the trainers who are employed by the government. And just in case there is still more work, then with that, we request for the recruitment of cancer trainers. And the recruitment of the cancer trainer is also a process whereby uh, when the request is made, then we request the chief principal to employ for us the cancer trainers. Uh, people apply, both the current cancer trainers and others apply. And uh, just in case a cancer trainer is interested in continuing to train here, they are done what we call vetting. This is because they already, the HOD, know their performance. And at the same time, we also look at the survey that we always do at the end of the term. Like now, last term, we did a survey whereby the students also evaluated the trainers and they told us how their trainers were. And therefore, from the survey, we can always vet the trainers who are already there. And uh, those who don't go through uh, as far as maybe what we required is concerned, then with that, we do not give them another chance. But th those who go through, then we give them a priority. And just in case we don't have enough, then we go ahead uh, to get others from out there who go through that interview. And the interview involves having an expert already on the ground, interviewing them on uh, areas that we really require them to train on. Kwa upande wa wanafunzi walieleza hisia zao kuhusu karatasi zao za siku ya kwanza. Kwa majina anaitwa John Lubukeni Kazungu. Nafanya diploma in electrical engineering. Na kwa maoni yangu mimi mtani wa leo ulikuwa kidogo rahisi kidogo mgumu. Lakini hivyo hivyo nimepambana nimepambana nao. Lakini sasa kwenye challenge zangu hapa shuleni Mino na wakuna wahaba wa fitabu. Sam! Yani, afu klaus kubao msikila saani. 